Hey everybody, this is Darkside. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use a simple HDMI 1-2 splitter to record your PS3 gameplay using your game capture card. The splitter we're going to need is a Sewell 1-2 HDMI splitter. You can find these on the internet for around $25 and is a cost-effective solution to the problem. I'll be using this to capture video gameplay from my PS3 using my Avermedia Live Gamer HD. As you can see, my video resolution is currently set at 1080p. When I first set this up, I did have a problem with audio. My solution, however, turned out to be something fairly simple. I just ran back through the video setup and it cleared up my problems. I have my PS3 running directly into the Sewell splitter. From here, it goes into the input of my Live Gamer HD. The output of the capture card runs directly to the TV. I will be trying some additional setup types and some variations on how to hook this up, so there may be some updates to this in the future. Now, we're simply going to hit the Start button and see if it captures correctly. We're going to be starting up Red Dead Redemption Undead Nightmare, so we can see if this is going to record. As you can see, there are no errors when hitting the Record button, and capture seems to be normal. I do apologize for the video quality. I do not own a camcorder, so I have to record this from my iPad. And although it does have very good features, the camera isn't all that great when it comes to making video. I will be including the video that we're recording here at the end of this so you can see this in action. I hope this helps you. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. A bit of additional information on this. We are getting ready to actually load up the game, this being the file that I recorded in Rec Central. I did not realize whenever I was first starting this up that the game itself is actually only a 720p game. And unfortunately, it seems that all of the games I have are in 720p only. Now, I have no idea if this directly affects anything. If I were to take this off and try to record it without this particular splitter, it would give me an error and would not continue. So I'm assuming that this does not matter. The idea still seems to be perfectly sound. But at any rate, we're going to go ahead and let this finish out to the end of this little particular video here. Thanks guys for watching, we'll see you next time.